Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Loud, loud quiet. quiet. Ooh, Empty Nester. Okay. What, is that? what does that mean? Yeah, I think that actually probably is the theme of yeah. the Empty what? Nest. Mm. What, are we, what are we doing? Let's do this. Let's do this thing. I don't know if I'm recording. Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> great. Sans Dude. children. Dude. Just us. We need a tissue box up here to follow along on our journey and maybe, you know, we can learn from others. Yeah. I don't have a clue how to be Empty Nester. There. This is the Loud Quiet Living, living the, the Empty, empty nest. nest. Hey, everyone. Episode 36 of The Loud Quiet. Thanks again for listening. We, we really do appreciate knowing that y'all are out there listening to us as we navigate this empty nest thing. Mm-hmm. It's got its highs, it's got its lows, but it yeah. is great to have y'all there. Yeah, last week's episode was fun, and, you know, and mo- most of ours have been pretty lighthearted. We've had some more serious discussions, you know, yeah. and <clears throat> we were... <laughs> trying to figure out, well, what do we talk about this week? And you know what? We're just kind of in a funk right now. Like, their kids are great. They are doing amazing things. But all the grades, all the ambitions, all of that is Everything is really good. It's just our our health. Yeah. We've got our health. Yeah. Uh, Our kids are healthy. There's a lot that's good. We get to do things. But then there's, you know, some things that are just kind of, you know, making things not difficult but just not as fun as you know there's a something that i don't want to say but i am going to say is that sometimes it feels like it steals a little of the joy Mm -hmm. that and that's the part that actually i have to guard against is not letting that happen but as a as a human as as someone with emotions well Well, yeah and what do they say joy is not you know it's Oh, you I, have to choose to be happy. Yeah. Joy you should always have in your life. But, you know, there there's times that you, you know, you just look and the sermon today was about prayer. Yeah. And, you know, there's times you're like, are you hearing are you our prayer? Because we've been praying it for yeah. a long time. And yeah. it's just, and yes. We know he is, and yes, we know it's in his timing, but, you know, and I think just also being in Austin yesterday and, you know, seeing your mom and it it, it just... It's such a delight to be able to see her. And there's times, like, we laughed when we were there. There are things that... Yeah. (laughs) There are things that... But there are times, you may have even seen me just turn around and stare out the window, because when you see the woman, what she... I know we've actually talked about this on the show, but it's just like that just starts to wear on you. You see someone who was so vibrant <sighs> and has just had her. Yeah. Well, and I think Alzheimer's also that sucks. it yesterday was really the first time during both visits that there was just no, no. things have started to change a little bit, even more so. And it's just her eyes tracked me. Right, yeah. but that, mm-hmm. and to be clear, not to say me, but it, that's just it, it's. Anyway, so it, that's uh, like that's yeah. why you and I were struggling with what to do because I, I think some of our energy is just sucked out right now. There's, there's yeah, some... and we have so many things coming up to look forward to, but yeah, the, the day to day and and especially because there are several things wrapped up with, you know, your mom's situation family situations, extended family situations. And so, yeah, it just feels like a lot of our conversations lately have been consumed by, okay, what are the next things that need to be done? What are the, you know, what do we just talk about on this walk that we just did? It's like, okay, so I'm going to send this email to this person. And and none of these are necessarily (laughs) bad. (laughs) I can't remember. It's a little windy here today. (laughs) Nothing. I, Everything I'm no. describing here is no like yeah. to have to take care of this item to take care of that. I'm uh, to some degree, thank goodness we have the chance to take care of it. It's yeah. just, I think, okay, taking this back to the empty nest conversation, I think the way I'm feeling and, and the way you're feeling right now is sort of a reminder that it didn't just turn rainbows and unicorns no. when the kids mm-hmm. left. There's a lot of rainbows and a lot of unicorns, yeah. but. Mm. Well, there's a lot of trolls and underpasses, too. Sure. I mean, I think, you know, we also had just a not-so-great travel day yesterday. If you live anywhere near the Dallas area, you know, it was just 
covered with storms and rain. And so we did the day trip to Austin, which ended up turning into a, you know, even longer trip. Made it made it both ways fine, but just with some Well, when you have three added, hours, yeah. total three hours delay yeah. so, in a day trip, well, it wears on you. Yeah. And so, you know, I think we were just tired. We, we were just like, what can we talk about? And so, well, yeah, it's just, and I think also... I think your sister said it good yesterday. We, you know, we're having to talk about some things and she said, you know, I just wish we could go back. I wish my mom didn't have Alzheimer's. I wish, you know, things went back to the way they were. Yeah. And, you know, yeah, we all do. And it just, it, it resonated with all of us. Cause we're like, yeah, no, we, yeah. we definitely agree with that. And, yeah. you know, I, it's a struggle with the, with the, the job right now. <laughs> you know, my, my company is, is I've been at it for seven years. And 24 is a hard year for a lot of businesses. I'm not mm -hmm. unique in this. And it's been a, a struggle. And it's one of those, maybe this is kind of how it's all woven together. When you're doing all the right things, but the results aren't there, that's what can be so frustrating. Mm -hmm. And not that there's anything to do or not do with my mom's Alzheimer's, but you just, you feel powerless. Yeah, and that's I think in that every, feeling of powerlessness. I mean, is, you can make that statement with anything. Yeah. Lose it losing weight get you know if you're doing all the right things and it's still not working then what what else needs to be tweaked or changed and, and that, that's but I, you know what to take that though just to say i this isn't a case of what else needs to be no, tweaked I know. or changed i i it's just the I way know. it is I know. and that's a hard no because i know what you're doing yeah. and i know how you know you did though change some things this year and they were very beneficial. Oh yeah, and but so not to the point just, of a client. Yeah. Yet, and so that's the, that's the, that's the challenge. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, <laughs> and there you go. There's our grumble, grumble. Yeah. Well, there's our venting, and I mean that's what we said yesterday. Rachel was like, I just feel like I'm, like I'm venting all the time, but you know what? And do you, you feel? It, do you ever feel guilty about venting? Because I do sometimes. Like right now, I just had this guilt feeling because you know what? We are healthy. It's a sunny day right here behind the cameras, a beautiful home and beautiful kids and all of that. Sometimes I, I find myself, I feel guilty. And then I'm like, well, no, it's okay for something to suck. I think you should feel guilty or not. If you're venting and not trying to do something about the things that you're venting about, that's when it gets a little bit like, okay. You know, we can't just keep going down the woe is me path. Yeah, then and you're the, whining. You, right. I, I mean, so, but, you know, it's not like we're not doing things to I, get, yeah. get in every in every single one of these situations. I know, was we meaning, could bury our heads in the sand and not be involved with anything going on in sure. Austin, but we choose not to. And it's, it's that and it's that there is so much that's going on good that it's, yeah. it, it, that's the part that I but sometimes wonder, but it's you fine know. to be angry. It's fine Come to be, on. I mean, God gave us emotions yeah. for a reason. Let's we're not all, bit. we're not yeah. always supposed to be Pollyanna about everything. If we did, we'd all be, I don't know, living in a cardboard box somewhere. I mean, you know, there's times that you gotta, you know, and again, I'm not saying it, I don't know what I'm trying to say. It's just, yes, I think it's fine. There are times that you have to oh, yeah. express your emotions and vent and be angry and be, this is not fair. Yeah. yeah. So. But then, yeah, but then you do. You look at everything that's going on great in our lives. Well, so. yeah. Okay. I, 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 you know, there are bombs falling on us, right? You know, there are countries that are at war right now. It's a, yeah. That's the part that it's, yeah, but. Well, and even like Rachel said yesterday, I keep bringing up, Rachel, but even because we just had a long talk, you know, said there are family situations that are way worse than yeah. what we're dealing with. And, we're, I, and I know we are, we are blessed that there are sources, resources to be able to provide the type of care that your yeah. mom is getting and Nana is getting, but yeah, and yeah, there are. But when you're in it, it sucks. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. So we hope that inspired <laughs> everyone. Yeah. So there's our little clip of. If you were if know. you were <laughs> listening to this while you were running, or say you were at the gym using this <laughs> podcast as motivation, maybe just gave you a little burst of 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah tell anger. us what you're angry about. <laughs> Vince with us. <laughs> Next episode, everybody's complaints on. <laughs> Give me your list of grievances and we will go. We will <laughs> air your <laughs> grievances. <laughs> oh, gosh, All right, well, we're ending this one because it's the wind is cold here. It's April and it's cold and I don't like it. So. There's my there's my grievance right there at the end. So. I love it. So, well, yeah. I'm I'm counting on a, a more positive element next week. I, I think it's going to be there. For today, though, I think we will close out another episode <laughs> of the Loud Quiet Living, Living the Empty, empty Nest. nest.